So the Miles Craft or the classic Blue Bot. The differences. Why I would choose one over the other. Are there any differences? Is one better than the other? Let's find out. Now, I've been using these for months. Uh, I've had this a little over a month, a couple months now, actually, right around Thanksgiving. This is just after Christmas, so just before Thanksgiving, I think I got this. Somewhere around there, a month or two, I've been using this. I got that. And then uh, I've had the glue bots forever. These are my preferred size, the mid-size, for cutting board glue-ups. I have bigger ones. I have smaller ones. I have the bigger one of both of these. This only comes in this 5-ounce. And I think the other one's a 16 ounce or 15 ounce. This is, I don't know, I think it's a, what does it say, 6 ounce. So it's got an extra ounce in this mid-size bottle. And then it has a 16 ounce. I generally use this size more. I haven't even put the glue in the 16 ounce or 15 ounce of the Glue Mate 150 yet. Because I've been just using this. I, I've been sick and... and haven't really been doing a lot of big glue ups, but I have been doing a lot of stuff. And I do find this size is my preferred size in, in both. The differences aren't a lot. They both work. They both have the general same setup with the, you don't need to turn it upside down and, and squeeze like you do a glue bottle. I mean, a ketchup bottle or anything like that. They both have nice covers. I will say... The uh, Glue Mate, Glue Mate 150 Miles Craft has two tips, and you keep the extra tip right on the bottle, and you can switch right back and forth between them. And one is just a point, and one is actually made to go inside. Uh, like biscuit joints or loose tenon joints. I actually find myself using this a lot more than this, which is why it was on there, for pretty much everyday all around use. It's very similar in profile as the glue bot. And I kind of like that you can just switch them back and forth and they're both on here. This comes with extra tips. Couldn't even tell you where they are. They come in a bag. Bag's probably lost. <laughs> Long gone. They both work pretty similarly. They both come into little covers. These are a lot more flexible, but I actually find I kind of like these more, even though, as you saw, I have a, sometimes a struggle getting these on and off. They're more positive glue caps, I guess. And I have a harder, that it sounds stupid, but this yellow is harder to lose than these semi-transparent red. Even though there's red, you should see it. It, it kind of blends. These don't stay on so well. These go on and they seal. The other big thing that I find is a difference between the two is the sealing systems. The glue bot has an o-ring the glue mate does not the glue mate seals just fine these o-rings are one of the major irritations to me with the glue bot and i have discovered if you take that out yes you can use it it does leak and it makes a mess um, it doesn't necessarily leak out here it leaks into this whole threaded area and makes it a mess if you ever have to take it off or change it or anything. Um, so I will go with the glue mate there for a win. There are a lot more positive seating. This also applies to the filler cap, which of course now I can't get off. Um, there's no O-ring in there, but it seals much better. It's got this inner ring here that seals up against the inner ring of the bottle in here so it doesn't leak it doesn't let air out they are um a little rougher to get on and off it's a little tighter 
but in a way that's actually good as long as you actually seat it all the way because it doesn't leak. Again, the glue bot, which I'm going to have a hard time getting off to, has an O-ring, which they always screw up and tear. And I mean, they work, but it's a, it's a maintenance issue in the long run, especially when you're doing a lot of glue-ups. I've ripped a couple of these already and had to go. I actually went to the local hardware store to get new O-rings. I have yet to have to worry about it with this. So that's another place I kind of lean toward this glue mate. Price-wise, I think they're about the same. I think I got these as a kit. I got the two of them for like 15 bucks. These are 8, 10, 12 bucks a piece, depending on what size you get. Um, most of them are never above eight. They're always on sale. And I think on Amazon, you can actually get the three of these in a kit for 15 or 20 bucks. So price isn't really a, a difference. Over one of those, I will take these style bottles any day. And here's the Gloomate 16 ounce or 15 ounce, 15 ounce. It's 15 ounce. The uh, glue bots. I don't know if you can read it. I've had this a very long time, but that's a 16 ounce right there. I don't know if you can read it because this is all dirty and I, I use this a lot. Or I used to use this a lot. I still use it. I just have lately I've been doing smaller projects, so I use these more than the bigger bottles. Again, comes with two different tips. These do come with more tips. They come in a bag. This is kind of nice that this comes up here and sits there on top that you can take it off and put it on the top here. But I have found it doesn't hold well and it just ends up falling off. All in all, I got to say, I find myself grabbing this more. I find it a little more pleasant to use the glue mate over the glue bot. Just because it's a little more, everything's a little more positive. These are a little more positive sealing. They hold better. It's not clogged all the time because this actually seals and goes on and off. I have switched between tips and it's rather easy to do. This is kind of obnoxious. Still, I'd, I'd take this over this any day of the week. Would I say go out and buy one of these if you already own one of these? Probably not. Either one's good. If you're trying to decide which one, I would go with these. They're both good. Neither one of them's bad. And again, I would take either one of those over this any day of the week. I only use these now for borax <laughs> and uh, for mineral oil because it's nice and thin. I would definitely take either one of these for a glue bottle. If you're in a indecision, not sure which one you want to get, these are a little harder to find. I've only seen them on Amazon. Actually, I did see them, I think, Woodcraft or one of the other places. I'll leave a link if I see it. I would choose the glue bot. I mean, the glue mate over the glue bot. But it's really close. I mean, it's just a, it's minor. It's mostly the tips and the O-rings. I find the O-rings in here annoying. Or just doesn't need it. I find these tips clear much easier and they don't rip. Literally the, the thinner tips of the glue bots I find rip. I've actually had to cut them because they've torn a few times just trying to clear them. If they get a glue glob dried up in there trying to get it out it, it's really difficult. They both work. They both work really really well.